What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of my playthrough series of The Second City. This is part 10. In part 9, our friend Fred set up a meeting with us with a guy named Evernote Blackwood, all right, to help us find Professor Harriet Doe. And when we get there, he actually, him and the Innsmouthers were under attack. So in order for him to save his, um, his team, he just, by the ones who were attacking him, which is the KKK members, he decided to leave with them in exchange to let his Innsmouther friends stay alive. So he leaves with them, and I guess they go back to his hideout. But then when he gets back there, he actually kills the KK members. And he tells the two group of people that they need to go get Professor Harriet Doe. So he grabs, he actually gets together a small group of people and goes underwater because that, that's where Professor Harriet Doe was. And he drops in into the water. And that's where we left off, where we have to jump into the water where he went to find him and figure out what the heck happened to Professor Harriet Doe. So thank you for joining. I'm glad you chose this video. Let's get to it and pick up where we left off from episode nine. It's been a while since I played. So let's read this little description here, a deep dive. Evernote took his men into the sea. Only one spot on the map is on the coast, the one in Western Salvation Harbor at the end of Pem Pembroke Lane. All right, so there's only one place he could have took him. All right, and there's only one place to go into, into the sea with. So with that being said, let's do that. All right, um, I think I got... I think I, oh, I think I have already a pen somewhere. Is it this? Yeah, this is it right here. So we gotta go to this location. And let's go. All right. Um, we're not, yeah, cause I remember I left off right here. So we, act, yeah, so what I was saying in the beginning of the introduction of the video, we have to go find Evernote. Blackwood. Because I guess he needs Professor Harriet Doe for something that he is planning, something very dangerous. And we need to find her to help out our friend. Um. Oh man. Am I going around? Is it blocked? Or maybe I can jump over it. I don't know if I should, though. Okay. We're going into the danger zone. Um. La, 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 la. Looking at something real quick. Give me one second. Oh, yeah, that's right. Okay. Oh, but I was saying, yeah, we need to help find her to help out our friend. Robert Throgmorton. All right, maybe. Oh, can I? Can I? Okay, good. I can probably jump over this. Go up, go up, go up, go up, go up quickly, quickly. Oh, oh, I think I made it. Yeah, cause I mean, this story is so complex. It's hard to like sum it up in just a few words, you know. Um, now we gotta go this way. So basically, this is Professor Carl Reed. He's a private eye. And he's having these visions. And the only place he knows that people are having the same visions as he is, is in this place called Oakmont. And it's been flooded. It's been raining for quite a while. But I think in the last episode, it stopped raining, which was quite weird. But yes, yeah, it is very true. So, oh. I think I got this a little too loud. Let me turn it down. Sorry. Okay. There we go. Wonder why I was so loud. Alright, so this must be the place. Here we go. So we should have a, a place to a jumpsuit or something or a Oh yeah, there we go. Wonder how we get in there. Oh, right here. Let's go. Cinematic time. Yeah. 
I mean, these cinematics ain't really that, you know, fun to watch. So let's read Noah's Dive real quick. Fred has managed to set up a meeting for me with Evernote Blackwood. I need to keep in mind that Evernote will be expecting Fred instead of me. The meeting is to take place. And okay, so we did that. We basically met him. He uh, ended up leaving with the KK members that attacked his uh, ends mother friends. Oh, snap. All right. And then he ended up killing the KK members, gathering a team to go get Professor Harry Adult because he's planning something dangerous and we don't know why yet. And that's why we're here. Ebono has taken his man to the spot and so okay, we're here. I don't care about none of that. I do have to be careful though, because this is dangerous. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Uh oh, somebody's dead right here. Oh God, what the heck, man? What is going on with? What's going on? Oh man. I I I uh. I don't know where to go. So we just keep going this way? Oh yeah, here we go. All right. I think we're doing good. Whoa. Whoa. I don't, I don't think I can attack either, can I? I do, I got this weapon right here. But this is not a weapon, this is like, or is it? Okay, we got that. I don't need that really, but I guess it'll come in handy. Out of these dead guys around here. I want to. Oh! Including me! I'm now a dead guy too. I joined the crew. Ammo with scars, fleeing is uh, often a better option. Alright, where am I at? Am I all, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I really don't know where to go. Um, Dang, I can't. I forgot how to recover my health. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I do remember being here. But man, this seems so... different in some way. I don't know if I'm even going the right way. I think I'm going back. Oh no, I think I am going the right way. Oh great, just wonderful. Oh, here we go. We made it. I think. Wait, no, this is the beginning. Oh, I did go backwards. Oh, man. Oh, man. I went backwards. My God. Okay, okay, okay. We can do this. We can do this. Dang it. I hope they respawn me back where I was just at because that would feel like that was just a waste of time. Where am I at? Where am I at? Where am I at? Okay, we're not going that way. We're going this way. What the heck, man? I have no idea where to go. Oh my god, I think I fell off. Oh no, I didn't. It's definitely not that way. What? Alright, hold on. Ooh. Oh, one of these things. I got as I gotta be careful with those things. That's what killed me last time. Or the first time. Not the last time. I died because of those. Those uh I don't know what they're called. But they blow off a lot of heat. I just don't know what they're called. Oh man. Oh, I can call my peer. Alright. Come on, you can do it. Get up there. Get up there. All right. Come on. It's not that hard. 
If you can do it there, you can do it here. Oh, there we go. Alright. Just gotta be careful with that. Oh, see, I just gotta wait. I think I'm moving too fast, that's why. Alright. Alrighty. Alright, let's do this. Oh, man. Maybe I gotta go this way. Oh, yeah. Alright, we're doing it. Oh, God, but we're dying at the same time. Oh, there we go. Finally. Oh, man. This, is, this has been rough. It really has. Oh, man. Okay. I hate that. I hate that. Right. Oh. Uh, I've seen Swiss cheese with fewer holes. Wow. That was super disrespectful. Hey, come on. What I got here. All right, let's see. Okay. Let me reload, reload all my weapons. Uh, I got one of that. All right, reload the shotgun. Cool. All right, I think that should last me a while. Okay, we'll stick with this. This will be our weapon of choice for now. Hey. All right, so people have been dying, obviously. Uh, I've seen Swiss cheese with fewer holes. It's got a nice little gun. Why can't we take that? And look at all these weapons. We could use that. Anyway. All right, let's head up. Hey, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. No. Don't do it. Man, he tried to blow me away. You seen that? Holy cow. Hey, let's talk. Let's talk here. All right, we don't have, we don't have to go. Violence is not the answer. Hey, right, look. Be a smart guy and don't do what everybody else has done. Wow. That's what happens when you don't listen. Ooh, hold on. Hey. All right, what we got here? Whoa. Nope, you're not gonna kill me. Oh no, he shot me. Near another. Oh. All right, let's see what we got. Hold on. I do got knowledge points. I got to spend those. Um. All right. I'm gonna put my base cam down there. I need more of these. Okay, good. I need more. I need more of these. But all right, cool. Oh, yeah. Give me more. Give me more. All right. Let's look through this real quick. Do I got this ready? Yeah. Cry requires. I oh, know I didn't. All right. You know what? Let's do it. All right. I got one more knowledge point. Ankle biter traps hold enemies in place for longer. Grenades and fire bombs have increased range. What we got here? All right. I do like, ah, man. Ooh. Mind. All right, so I haven't upgraded anything from here yet. Remain sane for much longer. Or gain a 50% chance to double quest reward items. Yeah, how about that? I think that'll be better. 50% chance is a pretty big boost. No doubt about that. Um, all right, let's go. Ebonote, we're here. Get information. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. You sure you want to do that? Oh, my God. Bro, that's the worst aiming I've ever done. Oh, sorry. Always tend to forget. I always tend to forget that. See what we get. I guess. Ah, oh, here he is. I know you, don't I? Maybe. Mr. Reed, 
from the fish market had business with that harlot Anna. Yeah, Anna was cool, I guess. Why Even though she seemed kind of funny. A little too cool, probably. Evernote, I presume. Mr. Blackwood. Or Mr. Blackwood. Caught up to you. You are a follower of my work? Oh, sorry, Evernote. My heart belongs to another. <laughs> Fred from the fish market said you could tell me where the professor is. That's what we were looking for. I see. <laughs> he didn't mention that I was about to wage war on the EOD then. Harriet Doe, where is she? Harriet Doe. I know you were looking for her. Where is she? Why do you need to find her? She has a purpose. A purpose that must be fulfilled. A purpose that you have no part in. <laughs> I have questions for her. I have questions that I need her to answer. Questions? You're like a dog digging for a bone. How dare you? You have no concept of the greater picture. The professor is the one. She is too important to be bothered by your questions. She is all that remains of the few. Listen to me. I'm listening. Harriet must live on the cusp of a great tragedy, and only she can avert it. She is one of the chosen, gifted with visions by divine providence. I got that same visions. Fate to either save us or doom us all. Mm, is that I don't follow. You talk about tragedy and doom. What tragedy? What doom? From beneath the city. Oh, but I forget. You would know. The frescoes here show the truth. I lost days studying them long ago. I once surfed the sea myself, Mr. Reed, but I cannot do so any longer. They have to be stopped. Harriet is the key. <sighs> I have no time for fr frescoes. Okay. Why don't you save us both a lot of time and trouble and give me the short, snappy version? <laughs> there is a cosmic cycle. At the end of each turn... I'm sorry. My time is too short. Please, find Harriet. You must make sure she lives. I must go. In that case, I suppose I better get a move on. Good luck, Mr. Reed. You must not fail. He's definitely an uh, end smiler. When you look at his eyes, you can tell. They got those same eyes. Evernote has taken his men to the spot in West Salvation Harbor at the end of Primo at Time for a Dive. Alright, so we got I know we got some new information here. Blackwood's statement. Alright. I found Blackwood in the temple of the Doug. Dagon? Dagon? I don't know. He'd come to free Harriet Doe as well. He told me about the prophecy. There's a great evil buried beneath the city. And if the chosen few, driven by visions, may save the world or doom it. None of these make sense, but he did say the frescoes inside the temple can tell me more. Hmm. Alright, so I guess we gotta go inside this temple then. Let's go. Whoa. The speed of a PS5 SSD. That was like a quick second. All right, let's look. It's a prison. I've seen these symbols before, but but where? Ah, uh, the first fresco. Since dark aeons before the age of man. What's that say? Thygonar? Oof. That's a tough one to pronounce. Lies beneath the ground. In the Eldritch prison rests a dreamer's hidden daughter. Bound to never leave. Alright. Oh, oh. Mind's eye. The power of the mind's eye. I don't want to look at that guy. Especially if he got half of his shirt off. Don't need to see that. 
All right, this must be a second one. Another piece of the puzzle. Ooh. It looks like a wheel, something, something repeating, maybe, like the seasons, some kind of cycle. All right, the second fresco. But there are those who would free the daughter. If the dreamer's seed would only pass to her, each turn of the cycle of those carrying the seed are, are drawn to the Thigonar, driven by hideous visions. Second fresco. All right, so only how, how, how many high frescoes there are? Okay, a little closer. E. Alright. Oh. Alright, let me use one of these. Yeah, I don't I don't Oh, you know what? Oh, phew, I used it anyway. Wow, that was fast. What the heck? Alright. I think we're gonna run into some trouble. Next. Seal. I'm sure I've seen these symbols before. Where? Alright. Not too deep for me, trophy urn. Third fresco, the seal of the Thigonar will open the way. Many will try to perish when the stars are right and the dreamer stares in his house. One will succeed, the daughter shall be freed, and from her swollen womb, the dreamer shall spawn once more. Oi! I don't know how that Oh, whoa, oh, what do we have here? Kind of scary. Kind of cool and scary at the same time. All right, there's an eye over here. Why? Why is there an eye over here? Anything special? Nope. Wow. Okay. Um. What is this? Man, this. Why? What are we doing here? What? what? Right, you know what? There's got to be something here I can do. All right. Should I use my mind's eye here? Is this like a podium or something? What is this? I don't know where to go or what to do here. I do hear something. Sounds ugly and huge. All right, maybe I need a mind's eye over here. That's why they got the eye right there. Let's see. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I gotta look over here. All right, there's a puzzle to be solved here. Hmm, okay. Should I go up here? What the heck? There's another eye over there. Is there another one? There's one up there. One right there. And maybe I need to go over here and then look at all of them with my mind's eye. Pretty sure I'm making this more complicated than it needs to be. I don't get it. Maybe I just need, maybe I just need a walk. Maybe I just need a walk somewhere. Maybe I'm just overthinking it. Can I go, oh I am, huh, should've known. Can I go up here? Yeah, I should be able to, no I guess not. Um, um, ah, can I go through here? No, I don't get it. What the heck, man? All right, let's look at my lore. I don't need to look at my, you know what? Let me look at a little more. It's just, I understand that. So how do I talk to the frescoes then? Gotta be some kind of way. What the heck? Yeah. 
How do I talk to these frescoes? Look like somebody tried to talk to them. Didn't have a good, very good experience. I know, I hear that. What is that? What the heck, man? I don't want to go back. There's got to be something I'm missing. Maybe. Maybe, 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 maybe not. So now we're... Not finished here yet. <laughs> well, at least we know we can't go back. But what? I don't. I don't understand. Like, I'm missing something here. Well, let me let me look at this. Look at my um. Oh no, not that. All right, let me. I want you guys to see what I'm seeing. Case book evidence, man. Mind's eye. I know the mind's eye. Oh yeah, re. Follow the omens, mind palace, archives. I know I'm going pretty fast. Ritual cognition? No. I know about combat. I guess. Guess not. So I gotta talk to these guys, but how the heck do I do that? Um, shot like. I look like I need to do something with this. I shoot it. Take a picture. Let's take a picture. Ah, took a picture. Should I take a picture? But it would tell me if I need to take a picture. Um. Okay. What the heck, man? What am I missing here? Is there something over here? I mean, maybe like I, I'm thinking maybe I have to go up here. What the heck, man? Alright, let's, let's, let's read, um, let's look at the lore real quick. Let's say, since dark aeons before the age of man, Diagonar lies beneath the ground in the Eldritch prison's rest, the dreamer's hidden daughter, bound to never leave. So these must be like... Alright, let's look at this one, the one with the oct octopus. Wait, here we go. Professor Doe, are you all right? Wow. All right? Uh, I, I am. Why not? Sorry, who are you? <sighs> you need to come with me. I'm here to rescue you. Robert Throg Morton wants to. Uh -oh. Rescue me? But I, 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 don't you understand? Everything is in my hands now. There is a cycle. This has all happened before. She wants to be free, but she must not be, or else it all ends. Tell me about the cycle. What is this about a cycle? It always begins with a great flood. Then the threat rises with the sea. The sea is all that divides our world from the one below. When the sea rises, the gates, the gates neither open nor close, only waiting. What, what gates? Gates. Katiganar. 
The gates are not closed. The gates are not open. I would have never guessed how to pronounce that. Ketega Ganar. What are you talking about? But that was close. They close the gates and close them forevermore. The gates will gates. You're feeling all right? Doe, you're not making sense. We need to get out of here now. Hysteria. I can't leave with you. I need to be alone. Alone. You don't understand. I play a part in it all, but only the chosen few may do that. Those led by the visions. I've had them for so long. Ooh, this is a good one. What do you see? What do you see in your visions? Horrors. Uh, nightmares. Alive. I see. Reality. Torn. Rotten. The things below and water. So much water. Water is death. I have visions too. I, I have visions too. That's what brought me to Oakmont. And I guess what brings me to you now. Oh, but that has that has to be that has to be different. It, it has to be. I've been through so much. It has to be different. Uh, I don't understand. There can only be one of us. Give me a moment. I need a moment to think it over. Okay. I will stay here with my seal. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, okay. Let's pause this for a minute. So he comes because he's having visions. She's having visions too, but now she said there's only one person that can have visions. So that's impossible for, for both of them to have visions. Now he's got to figure out why this is happening. Interesting. This is getting good. Oh, Mind Palace. All right, let's go there. All right, um, let's read that. Uh, another vision. It's happening again. Another one of those. Okay, that's that was in the last episode. Last episode, this is the new one. The prophecy. There is an ancient evil below the city, and the chosen savior led his fate by horde visions, conceal or free it. So I wonder if one of us is to seal it and the other one is to free it. So are we going to free the prophecy or seal the prophecy? Harriet might be one of the chosen. Recently, Harriet Doe has experienced horrifying visions. Could she be one of the chosen? All right, let me, let me go down here real quick. So we got EOD Nets Harriet. We already did that. Blackwood has a plan. Um, all right. I think we're good on that. Um... Okay, let's go look around. I think that's what we're gonna have to do. All right, can I? All right, here we go. Now I can mess with. Finished here yet? Uh. Okay. Um. Okay, maybe I had to do the mind palace. That was the point of us taking that break. What we should do? Yes. I will be the one who remains. Ooh, or we need to leave. Huh. Uh, right, hold on, hold on. I need a moment to think it over. Okay. I know. Yeah. <laughs> I need a. Okay. All right, let's go back to the mind palace one more time. Can I? There we go. Yes. I might be the one of the chosen. The vision led the chosen to the city, to their destiny. They led me here too. I am part of the prophecy. Okay. Put these together. The prophecy. Only one may survive. The prophecy says there will be many chosen, but only one savior. Those that fell will die. Can you see that? Yes. Only one may remain. The prophecy says there will be many chosen, but only one savior. The others will try and fail. Wow, that's pretty hard to choose the prophecy says there will be many chosen but only one savior those that fail will die the prophecy says there will be many chosen but one savior of the others will try and fail so either fail will die or those will try and fail oh those that fail will die only one may survive Wow, 
Wow. I guess I'll pick this one. It says the prophecy says there will be many chosen, but only one savior. Those that fail will die. Which leads us to I must kill Harriet Doe. <gasps> Harriet Doe and I are both chosen, but one of, but of us are plagued by these nightmarish visions, both destined to seal the evil under the city. Yet the prophecy says only one of us may live. Too much is at stake to take any risks. Wow. Sorry, Robert Throgmorton. This is bigger than you and I. I could change it, but I'd rather not. This is what we chose. Time to die. I know what we should do. Yes. I will be the one who remains. If there can be only one professor, it will be me. I'm sorry. No. No, no. You can't steal my destiny from me. It's mine. Oh. Okay. Well, we did all that just to kill her. That's crazy. Let's do it. All right, so this is a big thing. So let me turn off my camera. Wow. I thought I fixed that. What the heck, man? <laughs> That's my stream frame right there. Anyway, all right. Deal with the devil is the next case, I believe. I woke up in the hospital to discover my old acquaintance, Johannes Van Vandenberg, staring me down. Oh, can you see? Oh, you can't see that. But that being said, I do want to. Well, I guess I could do it right here. It'd be better. Staring me down, the seal of the Synthagonar Ganar is missing, and after I learn in the temple of the Dagon, I cannot proceed without it. I need to find it. Wow. That is interesting. Alright. So now those dive is complete. Deal with the devil. Alright. So let's talk to him. Cause it looks like we have no choice. I think, right? Or can we yeah. Actually, we'll come back to this. And actually, I want to do is, uh, I was woken by nightmare. I will, uh, another nightmare woke me up. The visions are getting worse. Eesh. Okay. So, since we're done with that case, main case, we're going to start the new main case in the next episode. Right now, what I do want to do is do one of the side cases before the end of this episode. So let's continue with Herbert Glover's address. Herbert Glover lives in Old Gold Bridge Road in Central Old Grove. His house is situated between Wind Half and Century Avenue. Independent evidence. We place it on map. All right, so we're going to Central Old Grove, which is over here. I think it's this big one. No, that's Reed Heights right here. Central Old Grove. Between Wind Half and Century Avenue. Wind Half. Okay, right here. On Gold Bridge Road, right here. So we gotta go here. Cool. 
Let's go. We'll come back here in a minute. We'll talk to him in a minute. We'll be back. Bandberg. But I'm going to do a side mission, if you don't mind, sir. Let's go. Wow. So we killed Professor Harriet Doe because our prophets say there can only be one. She was gonna, I think she would have died anyway. But think about it. So, but we're the one that killed her, you know. All right, where we at? Okay. So let's follow this. So now there's a prophecy. So there's something bigger going on. Robert Dogmorton, I do got to report to him to tell him I found Harriet Doe. But how am I going to explain that I had to kill her? He's not going to believe anything I said. He's not going to believe that prophecy. Gibberish. He's going to think it's all a lie. And I don't think he's the one that takes things very lightly. All right. Wow. Um, all right, so I got to look for a house. Maybe this is it. Let's check this house. Can I go in here? Ooh. All right, here we are. Heck yeah. You know what? And this is good because I'm getting so much more items. All right. We're going to use this. Soon as I find whoever's trying to kill me here which I know is going to be somebody maybe not maybe I ooh what's this why keep a 40 year old newspaper article an old newspaper Francis Dogmorton the city's darling scholar and adventurer is once again an eligible bachelor further text unreadable <sighs> the door won't budge the door won't budge whoa what was that? Why you do that? The door won't budge. Well, I mean, what, did I open like a door or something? What the heck? What, what was all that about? I hear a big ugly monster. Wait, what we gotta do here again? I forgot. Uh, I know that, but like, what, what is the point of coming here? Mr. Tomorrow asked me to find out what happened to Herbert Glover and the collector of fine arts. Oh, fine arts. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, maybe I can just kill him. Wait, no. Let me use this. Oh, that was a lot faster. My God, I should have been like that. But from the beginning, oh, God. Come on. Let's do it again. Okay, here we go. Oh, oh. Come and get me. Okay, that's probably a bad idea. Oh, this is not good. I'm really doing a terrible job. Oh, I'm glad I forgot I can build four of those. No. Oh my god, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons here. My god. Alright, shotgun time. Woo! <laughs> Boo! Sorry about that, that was my phone. Where's that house at? Is this it? Maybe this is it. No? All right, maybe it's over here. I don't know. No, it's not over here. It's around the corner. Wow. How much time we got? All right, let's see if I can find this before this episode ends. If not, we'll just finish this on... Wait, is this the house? Where the heck is that? What happened to that house, man? 
How's it not here now? Oh, it's on the other street. Okay. Oh, maybe I can go through here. Yeah, I think this is the house right here. This is the back door. Oh, we're one budge. I guess not. All right, here we go. Let's do this a little better. I think I was very terrible at doing that. I would like another retry. All right, where you, where you at? Come on, show me your ugly face. I'm not afraid. I'm not, a, why can I not see them? Letter to Mr. Throgmorn. How come I didn't find this earlier? Mr. Throgmorn, it was a deepest regret that I must inform you that the price of, for the peace you have requested has changed once again. The demand for it has increased, and now it is tripled that which we agreed earlier. I know this is the second time that I have raised the price, but the extreme circumstances, the flood may make each piece almost un unvaluable to me as I cannot replenish my collection. Herbert Glover. All right, let me just throw these down now. Oh, wow, I got a whole crew coming after me. Oh, he died. Man, this... Woo, boy, that was not good. All right, shotgun time. All right, uh, and healing time. What the heck? Why is there one right here? Oh my god. Get that. Get that. What the heck? No. Oh god. Whew. Man. Alright. I'm gonna use this big boy right here. Alright. What's next? Who's next? Who wants a piece of this? I think that's it. I think. I hope. Nope. Guess not. You want a piece of this? Can we go down here? I think I think everybody's dead now. I think we're good. I think I killed everybody. Can't carry something. I should use that too. Okay. What is that? Wow. Statue. Oh, there's another. It's that statue head that was upstairs. I see one painting. Uh, uh can I use one right now? Oh yeah, I definitely can. Woo. There we go. What is this? All right, pistol billets. Pistol rounds. I mean, yeah, same thing. Anyway, I just. Same thing, same thing. Okay, all right, there we go. Metal scrap. Oh, traps are pretty good. I just gotta set them right. Okay, I guess we gotta go upstairs then. Oh no, we gotta go back downstairs. We got, I got that statue head. I think, uh, here we go. Is that another what, what is that is that a, a first aid kit yep it's a first aid kit it's okay i don't need it i'll get it later i'm sure it'll still be there if i ever need it at least i know where one's at if i ever need it okay what's next whoa 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 boy dang bro eyes still wide open i guess he didn't see the killing blow coming man Somebody just threw a knife in his heart. He thought he was a vampire or something? Ooh. What's that? Looks like they're short of full set. One of the mirrors was taken. Hmm, very interesting. Should I take a picture of this? Maybe for... I don't know. Eyes still wide open. Guess he didn't see the killing blow coming. Usually it would tell me if I need to take a picture. Hmm. I took one anyway. 
Only slight scratches around the keyhole. Whoever broke in knew how to pick a lock. Hmm. Hmm. Whoa, whoa, we got the mind's eye going off. Here we go. There we go. Oh, there we go. I'll hmm. find out why the old ape wants you so bad. Hmm. He never found out. Somebody found him first. Hey, is there stuff in here? Heck yeah, boy. That's what I'm talking about. Wait. Oh, I got another knowledge point. I'm gonna spend that right now. Knowledge point. We'll go to... What's it say? Grenades and fire bombs have increased range. Ankle biter traps whole enemies in place for longer. All right, let's go to Vigor. Carry six more revolver rounds. Falling from heights deal half the damage. Your vitality increases further. Okay, fine, let's do that. Ooh, 25%, huh? Wow, yeah, that's a big jump. I definitely could use that. What's up with this guy? Ooh, what's this? Oh, I thought it was a... Huh. Is that it? No, that can't be it. There's gotta be something else I'm missing. Did I go in here? I think I did. Oh, yeah, that's right. A very 1918 lookish. Oh, look, bullets. Huh. Bullet holes. That's a lot of warning shots. Oh, did we do it? Oh, we did. Let's figure this out. Wow, one, two, three. Is there another one downstairs? Nope, I don't think so. I think they're all up here. Nice. Nice, right next to each other. Squint, run! Oh, oh Kay, I have killed him. Oh, he did it by accident. Easiest gig in this district. You grab the mirror. I'm gonna go see what other loot we can take from Mr. Moneybags here. Moneybags, huh? He, he did look pretty wealthy. Who are you? What in K's name are you doing in my house? Okay, let's see what we have here. Okay. This was first. Easiest gig in this district. You grab the mirror. I'm gonna go see what other loot we can take from Mr. Moneybags here. Who are you? What in K's name are you doing in my house? And then he must have tried to kill the guy, but... Squint, run! Oh, oh K, I I've killed him. Did I do it right? Yes. The men broke in to steal a mirror. Right. One of them, Squint, cracked the safe. But Glover discovered him and shot him. Second one killed Glover. Ah, the art collector's demise. Key evidence collected. All evidence collected. All evidence collected. No? I forgot some evidence. Dang it. What evidence am I missing? Alright, fine. Don't need to tell me. Alright. Delicate matter. The two men broke into Herbert Glover's house and Old Grove to steal a specific mirror. One of them, had an experienced thief nicknamed Squint, proceeded to crack the safe, alerted the owner, and got a bullet. The second burglar killed the owner with a knife. Squint mentioned that this is not the first robbery in the district at o of Old Grove. A cruelly drawn picture of a strange-looking mirror. Okay. The art collector's demise. Well, I don't know what that means. I don't know where to go now. What the heck? Looks like they're short of full set. One of the mirrors was taken. Okay, I guess I gotta go somewhere where mirrors are or something? I don't, I don't know. Well, I could probably use this now. And we use it. Doesn't hurt. There we go. We got a lot more life. 
Light bar is definitely expanded big time. Take this. Okay. Maybe I should go downstairs. I didn't find everything. Maybe there's something else I didn't see down here. I says, what about this? No? What about any... Oh, man, there's got to be something here. Maybe not. Oh. What? What did I just break? Okay, I guess there's something here then. Alright, I gotta figure this out. I'm like a little... Oh, okay, I gotta go to... I got the little book up there. Alright, so I guess I gotta go back to the police station? Where's the police station at? That's the library. Police station should be... Over here, here it is. There we go, let's just go, we'll just do it like that. All right, let's head. We'll complete this before the end of the episode. Let's see if I can hurry up and run. All right, um. So they kidnapped, they took the, the mirror, but something special about the mirror. Why is the mirror so special? That's what I need to find out. And man, they, uh, he, he protected that mirror with his life. That shows you how incre incredibly loyal he is in protecting. I guess that must be Mr. Robert Dogmorton's mirror. But why a mirror, buddy? It's strange because he sent us to go see what happened to the paintings. And it was end up being a mirror. Very strange. All right, let's go. All right, let's head to the police headquarters. <laughs> Investigate this. To whom it may concern, there is a conspiracy brewing in the city. It is the fishmen. I know you couldn't confirm my previous reports, but this time it's different. They are taking over. The rancid underwater gold has been surfacing around the city. Soon they will have enough to buy out everybody. Institutions must investigate this. I took the initiative and performed a preliminary investigation. Yes, I know. I, know, I don't, don't have a license, which is exactly why I need somebody who does. I am sending you the first batch of my notes. More notes will follow as I carry on with my research. The conspiracy is real. The fishmen, the fishmen regard Sims. Oh, I got a new case. Okay, another new side case. Cool. Uh, wow, that's a lot of evidence updated. Wait, well, let me get the case book. Oh yeah, all the glitters. Wow. Yee. Wow, that's gonna be a big side case. We're definitely gonna do that one. Okay, so we gotta go to crimes. No, not, not this one. Oh yeah, no, not this one, right here. Yeah, right here. Two men broke into Hover's house in Oak, Old Grove. All right, so let's go there. Uh, Suspects, victims, officers, suspects. Violent crimes, property crimes, property crimes. Ha <laughs> ha man, I'm good. Squints police file. Philip O'Connell. Alias Squint. Sex male. Age 46. Residence unknown. Crimes numerous. Burglaries in Ogro. Breaking and entering. Tax evasion. Wow. What a blur burglar he is. Possible associates named Sidney Stokes. Alias Nunn. Male or sex male, age 21, residence Oakmont, Mass, Northern South. Okay, we got crimes, jaywalking, loggy gagging, jury duty, dodging. Very minor crimes. All right, cool. So we found that very quickly, which is good. Let's 
we're pressed for time. All right. Place our map. And we can actually get rid of this. Well, in a minute. All right. Salvation Northern Salvation Harbor. West of intersection of Moreland Road and Salvation Road. Moreland Road and Salvation Road. What? West of the intersection of more West of the intersection? Okay. I guess that's it. And we'll get rid of this. And we'll get rid of this. And I think that's it. Yes. All right, man. Let's go. Man. All right. Where's, where's it at? Where's it at? There it is. Should be here somewhere. There it is. Right here. Good thing I found all these fast travel points. I think that might be all of them, too. I don't think there's any more. Maybe one more, but... In Greenhaven Bay somewhere. All right, here we are. Oh, we got to go here? All right, Squint, where are you? It's got to be in... He's probably in this building. I bet he's in this building somewhere. Maybe. Could be... Oh, God. Oh, boy. That's not Squint. That's not Squint. Nope. That is definitely not Squint. Okay. Let's look at this again. Northern Salvation Harbor. Okay, we're definitely in the wrong spot. West of the intersection. West of the intersection of Moreland Road and Salvation Harbor. West of intersection. Salvation Road. Okay, so it must be over here. Okay. Just go straight and left. That might be the place. All right, so it's got to be around here somewhere. Is that, is that the place right here? This might be the place. No, that's not the place. What about this place? Nope. Oh. Ah, this must be the place right here. Nope. Oh. Um. Usually I have uh, something glowing. But I don't see nothing here. Alright, let me get rid of that. And then let me pull this back up. Northern Salvation Harbor, which is right here where we're at, west of the intersection of Moreland Road and Salvation Road. Well, that's like right, maybe west. Okay, maybe it's in front of here. This is Moreland Road, Salvation Road. Okay, maybe in here? No, maybe it's over here. All right, here it is. I think this is it. Yep, we found it. All right. All right, Sydney Stokes. Sydney Stokes turned to a, a monster. All right, you know what? Where you at? Oh my god, what? Bro, how the heck? Alright, this gun sucks. <laughs> wow. That was uh, not cool. Not cool at all. You know what? Well, let me see. Alright, you know, I'm gonna hit him with this. Yeah, hit him with a bomb. He ain't gonna do that to me again. All right. Let's go through this as quick as I can. Uh, I'm happy to say I've never been hungry enough to consider eating whatever this is. Ah, it's an envelope. 
Letter from the morgue. Mr. Stokes, the price for a separate burial for your mother, Martha Stokes, Stokes is 30 bullets. The morgue cannot give you a discount. There are more requests for burials than we have resources or manpower to satisfy. You must make the payment in two weeks or we'll have to enter your mother as a mass, in a mass grave. Oh, what the heck is going on here? Whoa. What is this? Rest in peace. Oh, that's the mama. No honor among thieves. What? Is there something else I gotta? Maybe, maybe not. Okay. Is there anything else? Oh, I think that's it. Whoa! Whoa! Oh yeah. All right, killed him. Who's next? Who's next? Oh man. Uh, you know what? Oh man, come on. Alright. Get that. Oh no, I'm gonna die. Man, where's the where's the, where's the ability to get more life when you use those? All right, I think I'm done here. I guess we've got to go upstairs. Aha! Wait, did I just see... Okay, that is, the, is there something up here? Let's kill it now. Okay. Looks like Squint was having a bad day. Survived getting shot just to be stabbed to death. But who did it? Dang, it looks like he got stabbed just like the other guy. Um. Let's look at this. A lady? At long last, I'll fix what that old ape lover Francis did to you. Wow, this is getting crazy. I love these little stories, man. They're pretty good. Oh, whoa, whoa. Okay. Where are you pointing at? This way? Hark! Get away from there! <laughs> oh, thank what is this? Gods. I thought you were another monster. How'd you how the heck you get in the Sydney Stokes? How, how'd you get in there? Nice trick with the wall. How'd you manage it? It wasn't me. She put the wall there with some kind of hocus pocus. Who is she? You yeah. said she put the wall here. Who is she? She, she? She's our employer. I don't know her name or anything. She, she promised us a good payout for a simple job. And I fell for it like a chump. Sydney Stokes, I Sydney believe. Sydney Stokes, I presume. I, I, that's, that's right. Do I, do I know you? Don't think so. I'm here about Herbert Glover. I believe you know him. Or, should I say, knew him. Uh, okay. Yeah, he's the one that killed him. What was your job? What did she hire you to do? Uh, the job seemed simple enough. Go to the collector's house, grab some fancy mirror, and then hoof it out of there. Where is the mirror? So where's this fancy mirror now? She took it. When me and Phil met her with the goods, they, they got into a big blowout out and she shifted him. Okay, what am I to do now? Phil was the idea guy. I, I was... I'm just a sap. Describe her. Come on, paint me a picture. What did this woman look like? She was tall and thin, very thin, just skin and bones. Mean like a rattlesnake. That's all I can remember. I, I didn't look too close at her. Why kill Glover? Were you hired to kill the Collector, too? Or was that just for laughs? I, I, I swear to K, I, it wasn't part of the plan. It was an accident. The guy started shooting at us, and I panicked. You panicked? Really? 
That's your excuse. <laughs> oh, please, ASK is my witness. I didn't mean to kill anyone. I'll give you everything I have. Just, just let me walk. Oh man, I'll turn you in. Well, you've had quite a night. Breaking, <laughs> theft, and manslaughter. I'm gonna have to report this. Uh, please, I, I'll, uh, I'll get the char for this. You should have thought of that before you killed a man. That's true. Wh what do you want? <laughs> Just to check on you, so how you feel now? Probably not very good. I presume. Alright, that's it. Alright, what's next? Oh, newspaper, correspondence, letter from the morgue. Oh, we gotta find this woman in the mirror. Unknown woman took possession of the mirror that the thief stole from Glover's residence. She killed Phil O'Connell, also known as the street on the street as Squint. She said that she fixed what Francis had done. She may look old, but there's a lot of frail bone in her body and still more capable of murder. All right. Sydney Stokes testimony. Sydney Stokes, along with Phil Squint O'Connell, were hired by a strange woman to steal a specific mirror from Herbert Glover. Stokes accidentally killed Herbert during the robbery. They later, la later met with the woman at Sydney's place where she killed Phil took the mirror and locked Sydney inside. Sydney couldn't remember her in much detail, except that she was thin, old, and had a bad temper. I should return to Mr. Throgmorton to tell him what I found. All right, we will do that. And then we will most likely end the episode there. To the right. Ah, more people out and it's stopped raining again. Actually, the sun's kind of trying to come out. Nice. All right. Oh, that's the Devil's Reese Hotel. There we go. Throckmorton's Manor. Carpenter's Manor. All right, let's go. This is where all the rich people live. Them and their mansions. Or manor, like they call it. Oh, I got to tell him about uh, I killed her. Whatchamacallit, too. He's not going to be happy about that. Uh, I finished the investigation. I've looked into your delicate matter. Excellent. Don't spare me any details. Glover's dead. He was killed by a man named Sidney Stokes, who happened to be robbing his place. He wasn't working alone. He had a partner, Phil O'Connell. Didn't end up much better. All over uh, some kind of mirror, apparently. Truck. Where is the mirror now? Their employer has it. Uh, some mystery woman. I didn't get her name, but she obviously wasn't fooling around. I see. So, my enigmatic competitor has finally shown her hand. And the thieves are both dead, you say? Both of them are dead. Sydney is alive. Report him. Ah, uh, man, why? Well, I'm here to do a job for him. I'm gonna let him know. Sidney Stokes managed to make it out in one piece. Now, if I had to guess, he's probably holed up at his home. Want the address? I would welcome it. I'll take pleasure in uh, educating him on some, uh, shall we say, essential truths. Uh, could have told me. It wouldn't have killed you to let me know you were going after the mirror from the start. As I said, this is a very delicate matter. I wasn't confident I could trust you with such sensitive information until now. I bought reward. All right. I've held up my end of the bargain. Now, it's your turn. Of course, Mr. Reed. Here's your payment. Now that you know everything, would you accept the second part of the job? Let me guess. <laughs> you want me to track down the mirror? Should have yes. known. And the one who so rudely snatched it from my grasp. Except. I'm on it. Only got one lead, though. Our culprit had a bone to pick with someone named Francis. Mean anything to you? Ah, yes. That is without doubt my father, Francis Throgmorton. K rest his soul. 
How is he involved? What's he got to do with this? I found mention of the mirror in his records. That's what led me to take interest. Hmm. Do you have enemies? Or do you, did he have enemies? Your father was a prominent man. I'm sure he had enemies. Anyone come to mind? None would outlive him. I bought those records. You mentioned your father left records. Mind if I take a gander at them? The prospect of you rifling through my father's possessions does not fill me with joy, Mr. Reed. But if that's what you need, so be it. Take this key. All right. So we completed a delicate matter, and there's a second part to it called Through the Looking Glass. All right, and we actually... So we do got to let him know about that we killed... I don't know if we're going to tell him we killed Harriet Doe or we found Harriet, Harriet Doe dead, but... I think it's believe it's gonna be one of the two. And I think it might be an option. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed this episode of my playthrough series of the Sick and City. Very good, very good story. Both stories, side story and the main story. And uh when we begin the next episode, episode eleven, we will continue with episode uh six or episode uh or the new main case, uh Deal with the Devil. And um and we might also finish up with uh, looking through the glass, helping out Robert Throgmore and find that mirror. Okay? And if you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button for me. And if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Hit that notification bell. That way you get notified when I drop the next video or any other video I upload. Thank you again, guys. I hope you have a good one. And I will catch you on the next one. Peace.